going on people it's the xbox 448 and today i gotta say somebody has set the stables on fire um that sony spin cycle like it's full blast right now and i've been seeing some crazy things on twitter and i figure i'll share it with you guys let's dance the biggest thing that i see coming down here is i, I had a conversation on twitter and, and this is just one of many that i've had lately um and it's about the scorpio Yo, these, these ponies are trying to downplay the, the native 4K resolution for gaming on the Scorpio. Saying that, yo, most likely it's going to be native 4K but at 30 frames per second. And it's going to struggle with that. And we don't even know the specs of the machine. Of course, like, I, I did a video where I said what I feel is going to be in the, in the Scorpio. But none of us know yet. Nobody has said anything yet. It's a, I mean, all we're doing is kind of forecasting the future i uh, the zen processor makes sense um i know i said polaris but you know it, it could very well be vega but we don't know yet and, and and these guys feel like they're absolute professionals on this and they know exactly what's going on exactly what's going to be in the machine and exactly what it can do <laughs> again absolutely asinine but it gets even better right when talking about this um I said that I don't even compare the Neo or the PlayStation 4K to the Scorpio because that's what it was about. It was about comparing these machines. I said I compare it more to the One S. I mean, they're both machines that upscale to 4K. And of course, you know, Sony's going to have that higher native resolution, but that's a little bit different now since the, everything's going to upscale to 4K if you have that 4K TV. So it's a, it's a little bit of a different situation than what was going on with the X1 and the vanilla PS4. Um, but these people don't want to see that, all right? They're like, they, they insist on comparing the Neo with the Scorpio. And when I talked about comparing the Neo with the One S um, and the upscaling, this guy said, well, there's going to be different techniques for, for the Neo in terms of upscaling. I, I think he was talking about that 2x2 two two checkerboard, checkerboard that I talked about. You know, Digital Foundry talked about it. I talked about it in my video on Monday. And, and this guy has nerve to kind of insinuate that that technique, that process of upscaling, is kind of going to be exclusive to the Neo. Like, an upscaling method is going to be exclusive. Oh my goodness i i you know, i swear guys i thought i heard everything all right i you know i've been in in the gaming news i've been on youtube for a while and i swear i thought i heard everything but I, you know, on a day-by-day -day basis you know these guys surprise me uh the funny thing is man they're they're saying that you know these companies should focus on 1080p and maxing out everything and stuff like that and you know you have the the 4k and the 1s upscale upscaling the 4k all right, I, I, I call it PlayStation 4 Neo. I call it the 4K. I think that's going to be the name of it. Neo is just the project name, guys. But um, they're saying now that, you know, they should just focus on 1080p and maxing that out. They want the Scorpio to underperform. And the thing is, Microsoft isn't even forcing uh, developers to do native 4K. Microsoft has come out and said, Phil Spencer come out you know, and, and told everybody that basically, you know, developers can use this extra power for whatever they want. So they're not forcing native 4K. You know, the way that Sony was forcing native 1080p on their machine, all right? And then with that, you know, you're getting a lot of issues with frame drops and stuff like that. But we can't talk about that, guys. We can't talk about forcing the 1080p, getting frame rate issues and stuff, because it doesn't shine a positive light on Sony or PlayStation. So these guys don't want us to talk about that. So like I said, they're pushing the whole, this should be 1080p, 60 frames across the board. That's what they should use the Scorpio for. They should just kind of tuck that, that extra power under the bed, you know, because they want the Neo to shine. And you can't compare those two systems, in my opinion. 
All right, but that's pretty much my video for now. You know, as usual, if you like the con you know you like the content, you like the topics, you like the gameplay, definitely hit that thumbs up button for me. If you're new to my channel, if you just kind of stumbled across this video, definitely hit that subscribe button. Uh, I have a bunch of content coming out every week, including live streams, gaming news. We have a podcast on Saturday called Next Podcast. So there's a lot of stuff to check out on this channel. And hit up the comment section. I want to know if you guys have been dealing with this on that whole Sony Pony side of things. Do you hear them trying to trying to say that it should be 1080p now and, and not 4K? And these are kind of like resolution whores. So they've been all about like the best resolution. But now when it comes to 4K, no, 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 don't do that. Go back to 1080p. Kind of just structure that out. 1080p, 60, all the way around. Like the Scorpio wouldn't be able to do that anyway. But like I said, yo, hit up the comment section. I want to know what you guys think. And if you haven't subscribed yet, definitely subscribe. But as for now, this is the x 448. And I am definitely signing off.